Hey folks, my name is Mike Voico, former Special Forces medic. I'm going to go over a couple of tricks with the halo. You can use it for different things other than just a chest seal. So, you've got an uh, object impaled in his chest. You can come in here. Remove your halos, take your trauma shears, your scissors, whatever you got. You want to go about halfway. And you want to seal him up because the danger is the air getting in his chest around that object. Okay, so you come in there, just like that. Don't be yanking on him too hard because you can rip these things in half. And you come the opposite way. Okay, From there. And you don't hear any more blowing. So another trick you can do, say you're advanced practitioner and you put a chest tube in this guy and you need a way to seal it make sure no air gets in it like a good medic you already have your equipment prepped it's kind of the same deal you're going to come in one way and this is going to seal the chest tube around the incision site so there's no air in And there you have. Check it. Make sure there's air, air leaking. And that's some tricks with the halo dressing.